don't worry about it. My name is Eric B. Jones, also known as Bright Shine. I live here in the city of Memphis, state of Tennessee, in the county of Shelby. And today's date is June 28, 2015, early Sunday morning, time 5.05 a.m. And I uh, want to first say thanks to all my family members and supporters for all your continued courage and support for the team to uh, keep myself employed in this area. It's a company called uh, Chip and Management Services. Right there on Ventura Drive in South Haven, Mississippi, and I'm um, continuing to further my education by pursuing my social degree, studying business administration with a concentration in marketing. At Monroe College Online, and uh, I continue to work on my uh, entertainment interest. I continue to work on my music interest, and uh, I'm continuing to stay in contact and consult with my uh, attorneys at the Hewlett Law Firm. Thank you, and everyone at the Hewlett Law Firm for all your help. We continue to hold One Sound Studio accountable responsible in the court of law. We continue to hold. Carlos Williams, he go by the name uh, Lou, holding him account in the court of law, in response to the court of law. And uh, on today's video, we're going to continue to talk about African traditional religion. And what I want to do today is to refer back to some emails that I had sent and that uh, the professor. Uh, Reply back to the emails that I sent them and, uh, about African traditional religion. Email Dr. Uh, Joseph Sirwan Jabinda on May the 18th, 2015. I sent him an email. And of course, you know, I introduced myself, tell him about myself. And then I asked him a question. Uh, I would like to learn about African indigenous religion, religion. Say, uh, you know, because I'm studying my social degree, I would like to try to study African traditional religion, possibly online, at your institution of higher learning, Bingo State University, Makurdi, Nigeria, or possibly at another institution of higher learning in another African nation, such as Ghana or the Great Lakes, Kenya, Ghana, Tanzania, uh, and so on and so forth. My interest in African traditional religion seems strange. I thank you for providing me with the encouragement to continue further my education. And on the, uh, let me see, I know May 18, 2015, on May the 19th, 2015, Dr. Joseph Sermon Devenna emailed me back saying, Thank you. I'm most grateful for your encouragement and interest. When I visit the U.S., I will give you a call. Best wishes. Then, uh, let me see what name is that. On May 18, 2015, um, June the 1st, 2015, sent an email and to uh, Dr. Joseph Sermon to Ben, and he replied back. Of course, you know, I introduced myself. 
No, I don't know who I was. I tell me by myself. And I asked him the question. I would like to know if I could study African traditional religion online at BU State University, Makurda, Nigeria. When I earned my social degree. You know, Dr. Uh, Joseph Sirwan Zabenda emailed me back saying, thank you for your email and interest. We don't have online program in African traditional religion for right now. However, we have been asked to work on a distance learning program. I will get you informed of progress and information. Thanks for being with us. They don't they teach African traditional religion at Bingo State University in Bakurda, Nigeria, because Dr. Joseph Sir Juan Zabenda is in the Department of Religion, senior, you know, one of the senior head lecturers in the Department of Religion. So they teach African traditional religion at Bingo State University, Bakurda, Nigeria, but they do not currently have an online program. May the 28th, 2015. I sent an email to uh, to Reverend Dr. Enrique C. Ikiki. You know, I told him about myself. You know, introduce introduce myself. You know, I asked him a question. I would like to know, can I study African traditional religion online at the University of Calabar or another university or college in Nigeria or another African university or college in another African nation? Appreciate your attention to this now. Reverend Dr. Enrique C. Akiki emailed me back saying thanks for your inquiry. University of Calabar does not currently run an online program, but you can study African traditional religion at the online program in National Open University of Nigeria. You can access our website on this URL, forum.nationalopenuniversity.edu. So, the University of Calabar, they teach African traditional religion at the University of Calabar. But they currently do not have an online program to teach African traditional religion. Now, on June the 1st, 2015, I, I emailed Dr. Chinbi N. A. N. I introduced myself, of course. I'm going to tell my name and I'm going to tell her about myself, tell her about myself. And I asked her a question. And the question that I asked her was that I would like to know if I can study African traditional religion online at Kenyatta University. Nairobi, Kenya, or at another university or college in Sub-Saharan Africa. Thank you, Dr. Chinway and Moye, for your attention to this matter. On June the 12th, 2015, Dr. Chinway and Moye emailed me back, and she said, Thank you so much for your letter of inquiry. Thank you so much for your letter of inquiry on the above. I am pleased to know that you are interested in studying 
African traditional religion online in any university in sub-Saharan Africa? My answer to your question is yes. And the university where you can apply to study African traditional religion online is the University of South Africa. University of South Africa, Johannesburg, South Africa. To get access to them directly, you need to search online for University of South Africa online degree program. However, if you conduct the search and you still fail to get the kind of assistance you need, kindly let me know. Kindly God, your assistant, Dr. Chin Wei, Chin Wei, excuse me, Dr. Chin Wei, M A N O D. So we know that African has been established by the professor that African traditional religion is being taught at institutions of higher learning, university colleges in sub-Saharan Africa. It's a primary religion, primary religion philosophy. So, you know, they are teaching African traditional religion. Now, many other uh, institutions of higher learning these university colleges, they do not currently have an online program to teach African traditional religion. But that does not mean that they are not teaching, and that they don't teach African traditional religion, because as we know, the, the, the Department of Religion, and in some cases, the Department of Religion and Philosophy, they teach African traditional religion in these institutions of higher learning, these university colleges in South Saharan Africa. But many of them do not have, currently, many of them currently do not have an online program to teach African traditional religion. But we know that African traditional religion can be learned and is being taught and can be learned online at the National Open University of Nigeria and also the University of South Africa, Johannesburg, South Africa. And the reason why we know that is because I sent, I, I asked a question of the professor, and the professor emailed me back, making it perfectly clear that in Sub-Saharan Africa, there are institutions of higher learning, there are universities, there are colleges that teach African traditional religion online. And one of those institutions of higher learning, one of those universities of college is the National Open University of Nigeria and another uh, institution of higher learning, another university, another college that teach African traditional religion online is the University of South Africa, Johannesburg, South Africa. So, again, my name is Eric D. Johnson, also known as Brightshine. I live in the city of Memphis, the state of Tennessee, and the county of Shelby. I want to thank all of my fans, my support for your continued courage and support. And thank each and every one of you that are listening. Until my next video, take care of yourself. I wish each and every one of you the very best.